Temi, could you share your screen and can you open up the some of the Dar Global chats and we'll look at it together as a team? Okay. Oh, okay, cool. Mm -hmm. All right. So let's just um so this is this this is the main group. Scroll back, scroll up multiple times. So just go back, go back, go back, go back until what was yesterday. Yesterday was Monday. Yeah, go back to yesterday morning. So the okay. the goal of this ex the goal of this exercise is just to have a look at what's happening in the group. So, um, okay, cool, great. So, just first of all, um, everyone should be saving people's numbers and stating what their actual role is. I think it will help you, especially in the future when you have to reconnect with an old client or networking. But get into the habit of saving people's numbers. That's obviously just okay. Uh, I, I know that it's not just Temi and there's going to be multiple people here that don't save numbers. I'm sure it'll be the same. So just fucking save people. Get into the habit in general of saving people's numbers. That's what I'm trying to communicate. Instantly save their number and write what their role is. I do it with everyone. I'm busier than everyone. If I can do it, you can do it. That's it. So that's that there. Um, let me just have a look at this. Yeah. Well, 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 wait, one second. Could you please fix these? Thanks. Morning. Please look in. Morning, Amit. Please look into. The, um, can you bring? Can someone ask Amit to come to this call, please? Um, cool. Sure. Sure. No, no worries. So, so again, extreme ownership. Everyone needs to DM anyone who doesn't state a timeline for when they're going to give an update. So I am checking for me. Let, scroll down. Let me just see when he replies. Can you hear? one thing okay cool so 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 look a couple of things get everyone okay number one when anyone okay, let me just write these down uh yeah number number one when anyone states they're going to look at something timelines must be given i'll get back to you within one hour 100 percent of the time okay dm the person who is in responsible for it to make sure they adjust what they say I know that in this instance, he came back immediately, but often I know that a bad habit is, is that any update on X, Y, Z, people should set the expectation for timelines 100% of the time. That should also be happening in internal chats, by the way. If anyone is saying, I'll let you know, that will 100% of the time be an unacceptable answer for me, as it should be for you. So you should also, your own standards, not other fucking people's standards, I always want to know when I'm going to hear back from someone. Does that make sense? So ASAP doesn't mean anything. Even EOD doesn't actually mean anything because everyone has a different fucking EOD. So I want to know what time you're going to come back to me. Does that make sense? You know, Ali Abay, for example, works through the night. Uh, so he might respond at 11 fucking PM, but Temi will log off at six, right? Because you have different working hours. So people need to explicitly clarify what time you'll come back to me. Make that a standard in communication. And when you see someone not abiding to that standard, raise the standard of the fucking team and DM them and say, please state a time. Because it creates internal accountability also for that person. Does that make sense? Like, well, I've said it now, so I'm going to look silly. So that's just point number one, okay? Point number two, if people are giving technical explanations, they must just send a fucking two-minute loom. It's going to be easier. Because that's where Sawed asked that. So, so scroll down. Scroll down. She's, she's got confused, doesn't she? Keep going, keep yeah. going. Let's see how long this exchange lasts. Keep going, keep going. Keep going. I think. Keep going. Okay. Okay, fine. So so just procedurally, people should send looms for explanations. It's better. Okay. Um, so 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 just have people send looms. And as a standard, Amit should have his own quick little loom that also contains his historical log of problems that are resolved. Because then it's difficult to capture something like this when it comes to reporting. Because then he could just drop his mm. loom in and show the explanation. But in general, if people adopt a model of quickly recording a one minute or two minute loom, it's better because also Sawad could be sending this to two other people. We don't know what's happening with it internally and it's better for people to send looms across. So in general, if people, again, standard of the team, if people aren't sending fucking looms for technical explanations because it's to non-technical people, send it. If, it. It doesn't matter about, in my mind, I think what I'm communicating is obvious. It's never fucking obvious. People... Just, 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 and, and, and also people are busy. 
So they're like, well, what, you know, where is it? So that's just the next thing in general as a standard. So point number one, timelines, time. Um, point number two, send looms. Okay, let's keep going. Well, were you were going to say something, Temi, actually. You were going to say something. Or, or is it not no, really? It was my, no, no, it was about where this thread ended, but like it yeah. stopped okay. there and says it's working. Yeah, yeah. Could you please change your chain black transparent for the photo? Oh, I admit, cool. So you want black background? Yes, keep going. Is this perfect? Yeah, hey, we'll double check with Carla. Cool. Yeah, cool. Could you, can we please work on the end site right now? It's not looking good. Thank you. End site still not sorted. Uh, hold on. What's Carla asking about here? This is site links when you Google Dark Global. What's she, It's this. She wanted this to connect, like the Dark Global doesn't have a space. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Fine. And um, do we know why that is? Uh, you know what? Forget about. Do we know why? Let's just keep going. I just want to see. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Who's Ali New? It's this Ali. Okay. Can about? you? Can you? Can you? Um, people should fix naming conventions. Um, it's just. It's just useful. So Ali yeah. Yassin, US number. Just save it like that. Ali Yassin, web developer, US number. Something like that. Just fix your naming yeah, conventions yeah, yeah. in general. Um, so 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 that's just that. Um, okay, so 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 again, procedurally, as account managers, is is, is the Sebastian still here, by the way? Is Sebastian yeah, here? Sorry. Exactly. Yeah, no, I'm just checking. Cool, great. Oh, amazing. So 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 I don't know why no one isn't saying to Sawad, she's got unspecified problems about the Google or mobile view, correct? Scroll up, scroll up. So uh, where did she, yeah, mobile, here we go, scroll up. When we open, it does not look good, can we fix that? You need to, so who thumbs up, who thumbs up that? Okay, so, so, so how can anyone know what exactly doesn't look good if she's not recorded a video or explained anything? Can someone tell me exactly what the problems are? that she sees. No one can, obviously. Does anyone, do you understand the question I'm asking? There's confused looks. So my question is, no, no. do we have a clear list of issues that she sees on mobile? It's a yes or no answer, guys. This is not a trick question, I'm asking. No, 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 not from my side. I don't know, maybe if I'm in. Okay, so, 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 so second point, only Ali, sorry, only Ali, only Temi is answering. There's multiple people in this group. Engage critical thinking, people. Engage your fucking minds and also just communicate and reply. Extreme ownership. We are all responsible here because we're all part of this call. You can say, Deepak, on the basis of what I can see, we clearly don't have a list of the, and also Milan and Ali, if, with all due respect, if you're going to be here, turn your cameras on and engage, or if you, if, 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 or don't be here. But I don't want people fucking talking to their kids or half-assing stuff. Be here and have your cameras on or just head off. Uh, Ali, you're seen two minutes. If they're not cameras on, just remove them because I don't, I don't need people here that are on. I hope you understand guys, own personal fucking standards, right? It's your own standards, not about me. Also, um, okay, I see that you've renamed yourself, Walid, which is great. Guys, always just, because it was Mian before, just permanently rename your Zoom to Mian, uh, to Walid. Um, and, then, and then also state your roles. So Walid, head of link building, Ali Abade, head of internal SEO. So, so just always state your names as well, Ali Abade, that is. Um, so just do that as a, as, a, as a convention for the Zoom calls. So, so what's the answer to this? Temi has replied. Anyone else got any comments on that? Uh, I don't think we have a list. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, okay. We need to request that. That's been missed. For me, that's a big thing. Oh, so Ed, why don't we, um, can you record a quick video, please? Just on your mobile screen recording and just narrate all of the problems that you can see so we can identify what they are. How, how, how has Amit even thumbs it up? It's not possible for me. So that is something that everyone's missed. Does that make sense? There's, there's no way to determine yes. what the problems are. Yeah, thank you, guys. Everyone get used to engaging. Build that contribution muscle, okay? I can't just hear from the same... Again, it's for you. It's not fucking about me. Um, we'll all have meetings with people that pay us. I do when I have client calls. People value contribution, so contribute. Cool. Let's keep going. For the... Hold on. For the title... For, the title, for this title and meta... 
there's this title and descriptions which has been some uh, can you teach amit to write english fucking properly i'm i'm sorry but in the age of chat gpt people need to learn to type properly or use it it's a small thing but for this title and descriptions which has been submitted to google waiting to be updated if i'm on the other side if i am a critic internally at dar global I would say, why are we paying a company £5,000 a month when the head of web development can't even write fucking English? Would that be a logical thing to say? Yeah, so so this is unacceptable in a client group. Guys, everyone raise your fucking standards. Do not accept that within your own team. You can't have... I, I don't accept anymore with ChatGPT and Grammarly, people writing shit English because it's just lazy. I'd be like, it doesn't matter. It's it's just it's just lazy. If they say I use chat G, I use chat GPT and Grammarly, and this is what came up would be a different thing. But he's clearly not fucking used it, and you clearly he's not clearly been given the discipline to be told that you can't fucking write like that, bro. Because if someone like Deepak or Temi's on the other side, I would talk to their account manager, and as soon as there's a problem, I'd be like, well, how can you expect them to fix React development problems? Their web developers can't even fucking write English. They probably go into a corner. They don't know what you're fucking saying, Carla. But they just nod their head and say, cool, okay, okay. And that would be logical for her to agree with that. I would, I would, I would think that. So, so that is a standard that we must change. Scroll back up now. Scroll back up to Carla's problem about this. Or so, still not. By the way, sorry, sorry, sorry. Say, go ahead. So, say again, Sebastian. Sorry for interrupting. Amit's here on the call. Yeah, cool. So you know. No, no, cool. Amit, um, you understand what I'm saying, bro? Right? You need to write English properly. There's no sure. excuses. You you agree, right? Chat GPT, Grammarly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and 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 don't get me wrong, everyone else in this group is responsible as well because they can see that and they're allowing bad English in front of the client, which for me is just not acceptable because it's poor fucking personal standards. So let's keep going. So she says still not sorted. Scroll down. Scroll that was at 304. Scroll down. So I don't understand what Amit's saying there, but let's just who, who thumbs up here? Yeah. So basically, yeah. And let, let me let me tell you. Uh, basically, what happened is the meta title he, she, uh, she's asking about that it wasn't updated on Google. Okay. So we said that it, we are waiting for it to be updated from Google because we have some. Oh, oh so, so so cool. Fine. Always give a timeline, right? Predicted timeline. Because look, I bet she starts asking. Yeah, we down. gave we gave timeline as well. We gave some timeline. No, 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 no. We gave a timeline once she asked. She shouldn't need to fucking ask. No one should never need to ask when can we expect it to be done because it's an always the obvious question. There's no one who will ask about it and then just say, yeah, it will get done. Everyone's always going to think, but when? Fucking, you have to give an estimated timeline. And remember, that's why I bang on about building the timeline muscle because people will always ask it or always think, but when can I expect that to be done? When can I expect that to be done? So get used to giving everyone timelines because it will raise your own standard and it will help you. So always a timeline. Keep going. Keep going. It varies. Honestly, is done by it, but usually takes a couple of days. So, so I would then here put this into Chat GPT to give a bit more of a comprehensive explanation. If you don't know what the answer is, what is in my mind? I'm asking, what's why a couple of days versus a couple of weeks? How can we accelerate the? Remember, critical thinking, comprehensive answer. If I'm on the other side, I'd say their answers are so fucking basic, Carla. This is like something I could have read in a forum. Where's a comprehensive explanation for why Googlebot will sometimes take two days to 20 days? That's a big amount of fucking time. And does that then have implications for every other meta that we update? Does that mean that when... Uh, go ahead, Ali, Abate. Yeah, the answer for this, I think, should be that we have submitted the request for the Google to crawl it. Uh, it will be updated when it's not next crawled by the Google. So it's more clear to the client. Yeah, fine. So we can say that we've updated it and it depends upon when the Google Next crawls it. Typically, based upon historical crawl yeah. rates, we predict this will be in two days because based upon what we can see in the log file entries, it tends to be every two days. So I predict in 48 hours it could happen. In the instance it doesn't, we'll relook at it then and we'll then ultimately um, have a better update for you. This also, because my next question is, does this mean also DAR hyphen or DAR global is the answer the same? Because I'd think this is a client. I'd say, oh, wow, does that mean our main name is not going to be updated? Because if you scroll up, this answer has implications. Scroll up for, for Carla's question, which is still not sorted. And when Carla writes something, she's the only reason we've still got this fucking contract, right? 
because she's defending us. So she, the, the, do you see how that answer has implications for the main brand company name? Cool. And we need a great answer for that because that's their brand name. I go mental and I refuse people during application processes when they have a great fucking application, but they get Pearl Lemon wrong. They say fucking Lemon Pearl or they 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 misuse the consistent capitalization. I lost a job because I got the naming convention slightly wrong. When it's people names, you don't fuck it up and you give excellent answers. Does that make sense? It seems logical. Like if the person you're like, bro, it's like a fucking name. So keep going down. I just want to see. She says still not sorted 304. I want to see if anyone replies to this. Scroll down, scroll down. <coughs> Keep going. If there, that, that, that's um, not that answer. Let us know and implement it. Uh, oh, wow. Okay. No one replied. Keep going. Does anyone reply to it? Okay, no. No one replied to it. Everyone fucking missed it. Okay. Uh, stop sharing your screen now. Um, so look, we've conducted the WhatsApp audit. Do you see how many problems there are just in the space of one day, guys? Yes. This is, I, I'm pissed off that no one replied to Carla's main question. I'm I, I'm pissed off. Um, everyone missed it. So let's get people's main takeaways from what just happened. I want to hear your main takeaway, but also extreme ownership I want to hear how you can individually contribute to the improvement of what you've just seen. And I want a timeline that you'll attach to when you should expect other people to be able to see your improvement. So there's a level of accountability. Deep, these are my main takeaways. Deep, this is what I'm going to do about it. And team, you can hold me accountable. This is when you can begin to expect to see my contribution towards it. Does it understand? These are the three answers that I want, okay? Because we need to build a system now because this, I, I've seen enough to know that there's many problems across all of our groups. Does that make sense? There's there's many, many basic fucking problems across all of our groups. So now, in your own time, everyone one at a time, I want to hear the plan of attack for how we raise the fucking standards. Temi, go. I'd say the main one is especially giving timelines because we don't need to be asked from the client, like, when will this be done or when can we expect it? We should, well, I will give the timeline and that can be you can expect to see the change today in any of the group chats that i'm in since i'm in various group chats and in internal and client groups where any work that is due i'll give a specific timeline and not say end of day but if it's the end of my day then i'd say 6 p.m or 5 talk, p.m talk, uk time talk in the client's time in zone okay. their time zone they pay us it's our job i pay you that's why i say cet right <laughs> Right. I say CET. I don't say PST as well as PKT. I'm, I'm like, well, fuck that. I pay you. That's how the relationship works. Same thing with our clients. We reply in their fucking time zone. Does that make sense to me? I'm quite. Yeah, yeah. It's it's so 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 everything that you said is fantastic, by the way. I, I respect that and I appreciate that. I, you said we can expect to see it today. So is it fair to say then if I did some random auditing Friday, I would see yeah. no evidence of this. Do you commit to that? Yes. Cool. yes. All right, she said it. Amazing, great, thank you. I appreciate that. Who's next? Ali, and then Sebastian. Um, yeah, I, I need to make sure that our answer basically uh, makes sense. They don't need to really think about it. I should have answer that anyone could understand right away what it means. So I think I need to work on my answers and Give give clear uh, explanation, and if if it's something technical, as you said, if it's technical explanation, I need to record a loom, or if it's some something that needs some feedback from them, or we need something extra from them, I need to basically make sure I request. So again, it's it's more about engagement, and to need to provide more and request as well as much as possible. Obviously, because at the end of the day, if if we don't do that and we, we mess up, it's our loss. Yeah. So yeah. Okay. guys, I I I'm gonna I'll be honest with you. If we lose Dar Global right now during summer, I would have to get rid of people. I think that there's no and 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 I just I, I anyway, I want to find the right way to motivate you, is what I'm saying. Because it's not just about skip like Amit, if if Dar goes, you go, because we don't have any other React work, right? So that's where I talk about 
your own personal responsibility and, and also your own personal standard of excellence. Like for me, I'm like, I don't want to be in a fucking team that doesn't give timelines. I don't want to be in a team who gives two line expert. So whenever you give an explanation, the way that I always think about it is I want someone who has no previous knowledge to just come into that group, hear something or see something. Say, oh, wow. Yeah, I get it. I don't know anything about web development, but I get it. And, and that's if you subscribe to that standard, you'll be you'll do just just, just better. They'll be like, oh wow, when when Ali when Ali Yassin explains shit, everyone fucking understands. Amazing, he's the guy to go to. Um, so yeah, absolutely, raise the standard, Ali, as you said, with the explanations you give. That two line, you can do better, and I know that you know more, but you got into lazy thinking. You just gave a quick answer, and I was like, but yeah, but that. Like that, 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 there's so many other layers. What does that mean for Carla's question? What does that, you know, blah, 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 blah. Th thank you. Let's go, Malcolm. Let's go, Ali Abate. Um, Not assume that they are technical. Once mentioned also to just create a loop, two minute loop, explaining everything from the jump so that they fully understand what we're doing and that they get a satisfactory answer. Mm -hmm. As well as for me personally, I type really fast. And much like everybody, because we, we're going to continuously use the AI systems that we do have, such as ChatGPT, Grammarly, and so on, to make sure that our tone is crisp, or send a voice message um, to to make sure that our communication is well well reached. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you for that, Malcolm. I think that looms are great. And it, again, it forces people to communicate critical thinking, to explain shit which raises your standard, which is why I do like a quick two minute loom um, because you can articulate things. And then also, yeah, you're right. There's no excuse anymore for anyone to use bad English ever, in my view. And for some people that's like, oh, that's difficult, but it's, it's, it's how you get better. So especially, of course, <clears throat> Malcolm, native English speaker, the standard's even higher. I'm like, nothing less than perfect English, bro, ever, like, ever. And that's it, cool, great. Let's go to Malcolm, uh, sorry, Ali, and then we'll go to Sebastian. Thank you, mate, that's, uh, Ali. <laughs> yeah. So the first thing we take away is the, the timelines that we have to be clear with the timelines. The second thing that he, if you don't know anything, you don't have to answer. But if you do answer, portray it like uh, you are the expert. You have to portray it like that. You have to answer like the experts. Yeah. The same things they they can Google it and check from the Google. Exactly. But you have to put them into into the like this that it's how it's gonna work yeah you have to portray yourself as experts yeah and the third thing that i'm interested on the client message but we don't know the issue if you don't know the issue how how you gonna fix that yeah on the message yeah yeah great so she will again come up yeah yeah, exactly, exactly. So, so yeah. I think that that was excellent. Number one, timelines for uh, it's a, uh, Ali Yassin and Ali Abed and Walid. Our internal team, our standards are sh really bad, right? With 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 that work. So so so, holding yourself accountable to timelines to get things done. Number one, um, and also obviously with all clients and and any group, anyone who communicates with you at any point should give a timeline. Including me, by the way. If I don't, hold me accountable. Help me raise my own fucking standard. No one's perfect. Everyone will sometimes say, I'll get it to you later. You'll be like, oh, you know, what time exactly should I expect it? Okay. You'll be like, oh, okay, yeah, cool. Like two hours from now, whatever. But that should be a standard always, right? Number two um, is the when it comes to explanations, I always like to think of, I need to give such a comprehensive explanation that even if someone fact check me with chat GPT, they'll say Deepak clearly knows what the fuck he's talking about. Because everyone can get a good answer these days. And they could be like, but you didn't, your answer is so fucking basic, bro. Or chat GPT completely disagrees with you. So you need to give comprehensive answers. And, and, and a lot of people just don't. They give such basic answers. And I'm like, as soon as things go bad, that's going to bite you in the fucking ass. Because they'll just be like, well, look at the answers that Ali's providing. Look at Amit just thumbs upping stuff. And I haven't even told him what the issue is. Look at uh, Temi seeing the Dar Global question from Carla and just ignoring it. This isn't the team that's worth the value that you pay them. These are basic things that shouldn't happen in professional teams. Where it, Think of it like a professional fucking sports team. Wow, you're the New York Yankees and you didn't turn up to your game with your shoelaces fucking tied up. You are Real Madrid or whatever and you turned up and you haven't put your shin pads in your socks and half of them are missing. Get out of the fucking locker room, guys. 
I'm not paying you the salaries. It is like that. So we're a professional fucking team. So that's why I get frustrated. So so exactly, it's true. Like all of these things, raise a minimum standard and, and pick up upon it and get used to building that critical muscle. Because if you see others do it, say, bro, you can do better than that. So thank you. Thank you, um, Ali Abed and, and Ali Yassine and Waleed. <laughs> I'm expecting to see changes, at least from all three of you individually, when it comes to internal work, as well as obviously Ali Abed, your challenge is, is you, you're not directly involved in client work, but I do need you to get involved to help drive the growth of the team. Because the truth is, they, Dar Global and Pixel Field, they pay everyone's fucking salaries. Your, you know what I mean? My salary. They pay my salary as well because well, that's how I get yeah. fucking paid. I don't, I don't talk about it separately. So great. Thank you, Sebastian. I have one more thing before this yeah, go question. Ahead. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, Amit, whenever you do any of the changes in the metas or on the anything, do you submit the pages to the Google Search Console for a recrawl and request re-indexing of those pages? Because it's fucking a big website. Maybe once work's been complete, that's something that... Well, 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 no, one second, one second. No, no, no. So, so guys, raise the standards here. It's I'm clear that to... they can't hear. It's... No, Amit, can you hear him? Is your audio okay? That's the first thing. It was clear that Amit didn't catch yes. that question. Yes. Can you hear him, Amit? Yes. Okay. Yes. yes People, don't, guys, don't... So... In, in, in internal groups, with clients, it's different because we have to look like experts, right? Internally we can all be humble and act like amateurs and it's okay. So Amit, no one else, you heard it. Can you please reply? And it's okay if you say you don't because it's not, but it's just about understanding. So uh, my knowledge is up, up to just updating the meta data, just on the final step side. How it is scrolling by the Google, uh, I don't have idea. Uh, they, we need to just write a script that, uh, or fetch by Google, or we need to uh, add some tags or whatever. I, I don't know. Okay. Uh, okay. Fine. I have that. I, I can answer it. I don't. No, no, it's I don't okay. Know Amit, Amit. I can How tell by I your I, I can tell by your answer you probably don't do it. Okay, and that's okay because your primary. It's okay because your primary role is an SEO. Your primary role is web development. Okay, and that's yeah. okay. So Ali Abade, yeah. I need you to give Amit a training session to help educate him with some of the things that you've identified. Okay. If that's okay, Ali Abate, because assume that Amit doesn't yeah, do sure. any of these things. Malcolm, you need to be there. Ali Yassin, you need to be there. Anyone who yeah. wants to learn about technical SEO, mm -hmm. Mo included, obviously Mo, you can have a look at also, because I know you've got a, a good amount of experience. Whoever wants to attend that call, attend that call. But Ali Abate, I think the answer is assume that he doesn't do it and that's okay and go go and have that yeah that's okay he doesn't do it but we have the whole team of su experts here in the external team why didn't they notice this thing look I the think question that... is this what's the quality of our team why didn't they recrawl the website they are answering like it takes time google will recrawl, recrawl it and update it but they didn't the malcolm everyone didn't they knew that we had to recall the web pages how will Google Google gonna know that we have updated this thing and Google have to update it on, on the SCRP? There are a lot of the things. Oh shit! Sure. Malcolm, uh, other guys, don't you guys know that we have to recall the page after the changes are made on the pages? Yeah, uh, no, I no, I think I think you're right. Maybe it could be that we just it slipped our mind. Let me just double check search console right now. Uh, it's, it's not me or debug who have to train everything. True. Yeah, because we have the external team here. Mo, let me know if I'm he, wrong. And, and, do you have a response to that, Mo, buddy? I don't, I don't. Yeah, is that something you're involved in or not sure or otherwise? It's it's. I just want to understand. Hi. Mo, I just want to understand if that's um yeah, sorry, go ahead, mate. Sorry. Sorry, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, sorry, go ahead, mate. Uh, okay. Yeah, look, I I think I came like after like developments and stuff. And I think 
from my point of view, the website, yeah. when I spoke to one of the developers, the website is still in development. Nothing has been completed yet, or they're still doing, I don't know the process, but they're still doing transfers and stuff like that. So I think from my point of view, look, you know these pages have changed and it's going to change and going to change again. And I know there was discussion about the sitemap and the robots, etc. So from my point of view is, you know what, if you're still working on a website, rather finish it before you start doing anything else on the SEO. Okay. Because you know it's going to change again or okay. there will be changes again. Okay. So um, I think the website, look, like I said, I don't know where the website is now. I know there was discussion okay. about transferring okay. of it's, 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 it's therapy okay. and I, stuff I, like that. So, so uh, Malak, um, stop there because that's actually giving me quite a lot of insight. So, 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 okay, uh, okay, all right. So, uh, I'll come to you, Sebastian. But a couple, a couple of things here. We can kind of sandwich, sandwich some insights together here. So, Malcolm, as a leader, it's very evident that Mo does not know what's going on when it comes to Dar Global. It doesn't sound like he's aware that they might cancel because they have problems with our technical SEO and page speed. Because his answer, maybe he does, but you haven't fact checked it. But his answer suggests that he's un at Sebastian and Temi, he's unaware because that cannot be the answer at all, given that they might cancel because they're saying we don't need to do any technical SEO. Because Mo's saying, oh, we should just wait. That's the first thing. The second thing is that obviously Mo hasn't directly answered. Neither have you, Malcolm. Neither has Ali Yassin. No one's directly uh, and attempted it. No one's actually directly answered his question. His question was simple. Are we aware that when we update a meta title and description that we should resubmit it in Google Search Console to be crawled so that it updates more quickly? I think that that was the question. The answer is just like, yes or fucking no. Yes, I did know that, but, or maybe I think I knew that, but to be honest with you, I don't do it procedurally. It's a bad habit of mine. Um, and that's a problem with our process. And let's talk together about how we can fix that. That would be a correct answer. That, 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 there's simple answers to that question which tells me that there's a significant amount of disorganization within that team. One, because no one's answering the question directly. Two, because Mo seems unaware commercially of what's happening, Sebastian and Temi, because that's a weird answer given that what's just happened. <clears throat> and three, it suggests to me that we've got a significant knowledge deficit within our SEO team, which is okay because we know now and we've got to where we are with the challenges that we have. But the implication of it is that there needs to be some really intense training that's done potentially depending upon and, and i know that there's some testing that's going to happen but we should advance and accelerate that so we can produce better results because at the moment we're, 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 we're probably mediocre in our ability i'm i'm mediocre as an agency owner we don't do 10 million a year that's the reality i i'm trying to get better um but let's 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 action all of that okay Please, team, so that we can be better. Um, like Ali Yassin, I expect you to be able to know the answer anyway. When yeah, you, actually, this... that's what I was answering. Yeah, I did submit mm -hmm. it, but uh, the thing is, I was expecting because it, I was expecting, yeah, yeah. I was handling the dark global side, the, the mm -hmm. developer side meeting with that. So I did submit for the, the home page because I was aware that there is this issue for Parliament as well. When I search for Parliament, the whole meta title doesn't appear. It's just Parliament, it says. So I was aware of that, and I sub resub uh, I resubmitted for crawl, uh, but not all pages. I wasn't aware because obviously, uh, in my thought that SEO team is taking care of those because we have external SEO team for that, and uh, I have some other, I have some responsibilities that I have, and they have some responsibility that they have to do. So I wasn't sure. That, yeah. that, you know. Okay, no problem, no problem. It's, 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 it's fine. It's good to it's good to understand uh, what's happening. So thank you for that, um, Ali, and then. Malcolm, you, did you want to respond? Was that what you were going to do, mate? I know that Sebastian wants to give his takeaway, yeah. but, but go ahead. No, yeah. Mo is aware of the, that dog global and their positioning because he was in the meeting before. No, he's not. He no, he's not. He was he was aware and he forgot or he's aware and he didn't listen. His answer does not imply that he's aware. Does that make sense what I'm saying? Mo, yeah. Mo, I mean, Mo, obviously you can answer. I mean, Dar Global are having problems with us at a technical SEO level and are considering whether they should kill the budget or reduce the budget. Are you aware of that? Look, I'm aware there was discussions about uh, 
issues with dog global and I'm aware there's discussion about that they're going to leave, but I'm not aware about, or they're considering to leave. I'm not aware about they're going to cut their budget or whatever, but. Okay. Okay. So, 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 so obviously there's a discrepancy there, right, Malcolm, between what, so, what, so this is a common mistake. Ali Abade, you make this mistake as well, by the way. Um, what we do when we try and educate or inform people, we show them or tell them something, but we don't ask them to tell us what they understand from that. It's a key thing. Does that make sense? That's why I ask for takeaways at the end, always, because I want to see what people fucking understood. Because then I realize, oh, you missed the main point, or oh, no, actually, that's not what I meant by what I said. So probably you thought the communication was clear, which is fine. Ali obeyed also when we train people. But then we don't check and say, can you explain it back to me now or tell me what you understand from it? Because then if people are unable to articulate the main point, then they haven't understood. So it's not whether Mo was told or not told. It's clear that the message has not been understood. Does that make sense, Sebastian, Temi and Malcolm? Right. So, 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 so that's where it needs to be tweaked. Now, you can obviously all address that internally, but I recommend when you train people or when you teach people, you ask people, you do not let people leave the call without them giving their feedback. And you check for how comprehensive their feedback is, because then you understand what's been understood. So whenever anyone says, yeah, okay, I understand, it's not an acceptable answer, which is why I talk about critical thinking. Don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm not successful at it by any means, because I see that a lot of my messages don't get, and, and I'm still figuring it out. But active feedback is a big thing. So if you find yourself saying, cool, got, if people say to you, got it, you need to be in the habit of, but what have you got? Like, what have you understood? Can you tell me what your plan of attack is? What are you going to do based upon what I've said? And then you understand what people's direction is. Or if you're like, well, actually, Mo, I probably didn't make it clear. If we don't do technical SEO now, they will fucking cancel. So we need to do something irrespective of the website being under migration. I'm sure, Mo, if that's explicit to you, that changes your approach, I'm, I assume. Yeah, look, um, I think, you know what? From a technical SEO standpoint, on Dog Global specifically, because it's built on the React, as a technical SEO, there's not much that we can get involved with the. Okay. Um, so, so, so Ali Abade thinks quite differently but, about that. So he says there's a lot. I'm talking now. I'm talking now about updating the website and making changes on the website itself. Mm -hmm. As far as the offsite SEO, that's fine. That we can do. Like, like take for instance, if you look at the speed speed, now, the, I know there was an issue with the speed speed, speed on that website. And okay. there still is, there's still no, all no, Ali, 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 stop sharing your screen. Mo, Mo, Ali has got quite a significant, Ali, you can stop sharing your screen because I got your feedback and I'm aware of it. And I, I see that Temi maybe hasn't shared the feedback that I sent to you that Ali gave me to the team. Did you forward that onto the team? All of Mal, Malka, uh, all of Ali's uh, technical. So, 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 so look, it's, it's not for this call, but Ali, you need to create two lists. List number one is all of the things that the SEO team can do, irrespective of what language the website is on. Does that make sense? So guys, even if it's on React, even if it's on this, these, this is my view as to the technical changes we can make. That's list number one. Does that make sense? Ali Abade I'm talking to now. Yeah, sure. Cool. So, 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 so then it's clear, guys, expansion mindset, what are all of the things that we can do, irrespective of the language of the website? That always needs to be the approach. Because that, and, and, and build that list, Ali. So then there needs to be, it's fine. There needs to be some training and shifting. So Ali, please provide that list so it's clear for everyone. Um, and then, go ahead. I'm expecting the list from, from first from the external SEO team. Okay. So okay. then I can amend them. As, as long as this all happens this week, because there needs to be a standard adjustment and shift within the team, it needs to happen yeah. really quickly. And uh, obviously it has implications for every single client that we have, and that's fine. But two lists, list number one, all of the changes the SEO team can make, irrespective of any fucking language a website is on, these things can happen because they're simple. And then bucket number two, of course, is all of the things for Amit to do that need to happen that are separate. So, so, so that's that part of it. Guys, let's, 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 let's wrap up this conversation around SEO in terms of ability and implementation. There's some work to do here, as well as communication internally um, that, that, that needs to be, be, be adjusted to ensure 
that everyone is on the same page. Like it sounds so simple, but in practice, we see that people aren't. Um, and, 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 and even internally, we're confused with each other. So that needs to change. So, uh, Sebastian, you, let's go to you. You were going to have some takeaways, mate. Yeah. So you can obviously, takeaways. you can, you can obviously update that now in light of what's just happened. If you're like, okay, I've got some other things also. So go ahead. <laughs> awesome. All right. So yeah, just two key takeaways. The first one is if you have an answer for a client and maybe you think it's not comprehensive enough, it's just a simple chat GBT prompt elaborate further on this make this more detailed make this more comprehensive so that's a simple thing that can be done to ensure that we give clients the most detailed answers as possible always and then yeah yeah and then also if you spot a team member who has maybe not given a detailed enough answer you can do one of two things you can either follow up with the team member and say be more detailed xyz or you can reply to it yourself and say uh, or, or elaborate further on your team member's message. Yeah, good, good. Guys, I, 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 I we, we spoke about in trade training about everyone else and your network. It includes people in this team. Like, what does it say about you if you accept a team that makes mistakes? What does it say about yourself? It's like, oh, are you the kind of person that allows shit work around you? Is that the kind of standard you have in your life? I'm, I'm, I'm happy to, and obviously I'm using exaggeration for effect here now because I don't believe this at all, but, oh, so Malcolm, you're happy to be around a bunch of fucking donkeys. That's the kind of standard you have in your own life. Cool. Cool. Does that make sense what I'm saying? But that's why I'm quite, and, and, and be fucking brutal with people. Like be honest. There's times to be nice and motivational and there's time to say, pick your fucking standard up. Like you keep doing the same fucking thing. I'm sorry that I'm swearing, but I'm quite frustrated because you're letting the team down now. I keep asking you about these timelines. I keep asking you about English. Fix it the fuck up or I'll just go back. I'll, I'll need to go to Deepak and say, I think we need to replace you. I'm just being real with you, bro, because we've discussed this four times. And every time you said, yep, yeah, I'll change it. And I'm being nice obviously isn't working. Ali Abed has discussed this when, when it comes to the SEO team and the internal SEO team and the standard. There are times to be nice. And when being nice doesn't work, you be fucking brutal with people because people respond to different ultimately prompts. So do not accept in your own life shit standards. And I mean that internally as well. Nothing less than excellence in the people that you operate with. And sometimes people just need either, you can do it, you're getting better, or uh, sort your fucking game out. Like I spoke to you about when I talk to myself, I said, stop being a fucking little bitch, bro. You can do better than that. That works for me. It doesn't work for everyone. Some people will be like, oh, wow, I don't talk to myself like that because I go to home and, I, and that's fine. Everyone, and, that, and that's the importance of the teacher. The teacher needs to be able to do both, right? You need to be able to do and know when to use both, know when to be kind and then know when to push. So just use both. Um, great, Sebastian, are you going to say something else, mate? And then we'll go, I think, Kaylin, and then we'll, 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 we'll wrap. Amit's probably been called saying, why the fuck are you on this call? Um, tell, tell him to fuck off. Uh, Sebastian, go. Yeah, so it's just a question regarding technical SEO and dark global. I don't understand what technical items we wouldn't be able to do on React as opposed to a WordPress website. I, I didn't understand that there were restrictions there. Um, so my question is, why on different languages for CMSs would this be, I guess? I, I think that that's a question to address in the call that Ali Abade will have with the team to give his perspective. And then obviously it's a discussion around it. Very briefly, I would say that there's things you can do in Google Search Console. There's things you can do with sitemaps and robots.txt files that are simple, probably uploads that don't matter irrespective of language. Um, and they exactly. would be things that don't matter of the language because you upload a fucking sitemap file and where those kinds of things and what tends to happen what tends to happen is that when people and it's you just seen evidence of it in this group when people hear that there's a different language they cognitively get lazy because they think oh well i'll just wait until the migration's done and they don't really think about what can i do what can i do and that's the, so so i think that people ask does that make sense People need to ask the right question. It's not about you can't, can't, won't. No client wants to fucking hear, we'll wait, because in the end, they'll just say, well, we'll just stop paying you until it's ready. Or someone else will come along and say, we can do all of this stuff and we don't need to wait. Don't pay for them because they don't know what the fuck they're doing. And all it takes is a guy like me to come in on the other side, 
a competitive SEO agency and say, this Pearl Lemon don't know what the fuck they're talking about. Show me their chats, Carla. Export your WhatsApp chat and let me go through it. And I'll give you a detailed breakdown of why they're fucking shit. I, I would tear us apart. And I'd say that they're not the right team. Without even me knowing any of the technical SEO stuff. <laughs> I, I like, you know, just, just on the basis of the group. But we all are capable of everything that I've just said. Because nothing I've said is foreign to anyone. It's like everyone gets it. So, so, so cool. Great. Um, Kay, Kaylin, and then let's, 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 oh no, Kaylin and then Amit, and then we can, can wrap. Oh, there's Mo also. Sorry, go ahead, Kaylin. Okay. So my key takeaways, especially concerning th this topic that we have, um, something that we used to practice in the legal group was if we see a client and a client has sent a message in the group and someone that's dealing with the case hasn't responded we would just pop a message and acknowledge the message for the client and say good day kindly note we have noted your message we're working on it and we'll respond to you in an hour or two or by so, the next so, day so, so, so that's great but absolutely never use that language in a whatsapp if it's okay never use <laughs> that language that is just like what does that make sense so your your, your yeah. challenge will be to change the way you use language because that, that legal type of language, you cannot use it in account management. But your point is great. And I agree yeah. and accept your point. Yes, I'm still struggling um, with that, like changing the whole legal sense of the way I speak. But it was just what I took away was, especially with Carla's message, if you could just acknowledge that, hi Carla, we have noted this message. And also go on the side and like nudge maybe one of the alleys and say, Carla has sent this in the group, please can you respond? I've just acknowledged the message. Yeah. Yeah, just so yeah. that it makes it seem like the client knows that we are taking control and we okay. have, because sometimes when you just don't acknowledge a message, it makes the client seem as if it's irrelevant yeah. to us, whereas yeah. it's a main topic for them. So, so, so thank you for that. And that was fantastic. And I think that Kaylin, just listening to the way that you communicate, your biggest challenge is to unlearn the way that you communicate. Because even your improved version was too legal. Does that make sense? So, so, so I want you to throw yourself into the deep end by really taking hold of this US sales chat because you're too fucking quiet in that group. Tell me, told me you're the leader, but you're not leading, not in that group. You're reacting to the shit that I say, but you're not leading. I want a daily fucking update every day as to what's going on. And I want it in voice note format. And I want it to be two to three minutes long. And I want you to go to each member of the team and say, what the fuck's going on? What's the update? I want you to build a system and a process to create feedback. So you can have a five minute stand up with it. Do what you need to do. Temi will guide you with that. But I, that's your opportunity for accelerated learning of account management because I'm a bastard and I'm going to want daily updates. But actually, those clients are exactly the fucking same anyway. So I say that it's not like it's anything new. So I am asking you now. Your feedback is great. Live it. Cool. All right. Great. Amit and then Mo and then oh no we've got Walid also I hope your in I hope your mic is mic is fixed by the way bro um so so that's your number one feedback for today but we'll we'll, we'll discover it in two minutes so Amit yeah so uh, is your uh, internet is your uh, internet what's wrong with yeah. your internet mate yeah I'm I'm using mobile Maybe. data and it takes you seven are you working from home today yeah. is that why. Where are you? No, no, no. I'm, yeah, I'm. I come for the lunch and just got the uh, message. So okay, uh, just connect with team. So I, I'm, I'm almost in the canteen there. Okay. So I just connected with mobile and the uh, rainy, rainy weather. They're just disconnecting my. Name. Okay. Right. Okay. Understood. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so first thing, uh, I'm, I'm really sorry for what I have written yesterday, but uh, what happened is uh, I just read the thing. Uh, I no, don't. Uh, we read any message from anyone uh, who is replying to Carla and Carla and Suad was waiting though uh, when I was waiting for uh, either Ali is replying because I don't have idea about the that part but even though Ali has replied in an internal group so I just uh, copy pasted just shared that image to the Carla and brought uh, what whatever uh, whatever my bad is yeah so uh, first thing uh, I'm improving my English uh, yeah uh, and I was too bad earlier when I joined the uh, Now I, I have something uh, better, not not better. Yeah. Sec uh, second thing uh, uh, regarding the, uh, you can consider this as a question. 
uh, if uh, Carla or Swaraj is asking something uh, which is uh, related to Ali or someone else, and if uh, they are uh, in middle of some meeting or some because Ali was yesterday with meeting uh, some meeting and I had replied. In that case, should I reply or we uh, just inform them? Just uh, reply on that. Yeah, side? of course, boys, yeah. boys, boys. Yeah. We're a team. We we. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so uh, that, that was my only on intention to reply. Uh, one more thing, uh, what, what what I am uh, I'm facing with the uh, direct chat with the client, that they are sharing one by one, one by one things to me. So I am uh, uh, every time I need to check something in the internal group, whether it is related to the internal group or not. So why, don't we, why, don't we, why don't we ask the client to create a tracker? Why don't we say to them, look, yeah. we're going to create a separate chat with yeah. the, all the threads. You know, that's an account management thing. Find a different mechanism yeah. for them to give feedback. Yeah. Yeah. So actually, I have informed them. I have informed them that make sure that everything that you have asked for to uh, Swart, I have informed Swart that everything. Uh, let's let's put it on uh, on 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 Trello so that Amit is able to track all things that he needs to work on. So that's sorted. Okay. Okay. But but so yeah. so, so, so look, if, they, if, they, if 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 continue interruption in the group is affecting Amit's ability to do shit, then find a different mechanism so that he doesn't need to check the group. It's uh, These are ideas, by the way, that might not work. Don't get me wrong. It might, it might be a bad idea, but you know, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, Amit. Yeah. Uh, 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 what, yeah. 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 So uh, what I, uh, we are uh, just implementing the, uh, the, 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 the technology. We, we have uh, same like the Trello, the app, our, our internal application. We are just putting all the things along with the details on the image in that particular Trello task and just assign to that particular uh, person. The, it will, uh, if the mail mechanism is there, they will, they will be informed with the mail. We have WhatsApp, we can directly just uh, put the link uh, in the group. Okay. That is okay, okay. for us. Okay. Okay. We, we, can, we can just read over there and continue the, uh, the chat just be in between the, the, the Trello okay. task. Okay. okay. Otherwise, what happened? Yeah, I, I, will, I will fetch all the groups every time. And find lots of yeah. Uh, sometime what happened? Uh, I, I need to uh, review the last week's message for today's task, whether okay. it is uh, discussed or not. Okay. So it's better we 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 comment our uh, our thoughts our our conversation in particular that task. So okay. it would be good to try you can, the thing. You can you can you can stop there. Thank you. I think that sounds good. I think obviously you're you're here because of Dar and that that it's, it's important that we develop a streamlined process. Um, okay. Thank you, Amit. Uh, two things, by the way, separately. Yeah. Number one, Amit, I like your attitude and approach. Think about coming to work for us directly. I'm just going to let you say that. We'll find, we'll find, we'll find room for you. So we don't. We 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 were hired by your agency, but obviously you know how shit works. We pay them a fee, and you have whatever the fuck your salary is, which is less than what we pay them. You know that. Okay, yeah. So think about coming to work for us directly because I like your attitude and I think that you fit the culture at Pearl Lemon. That's point number one. Okay. Think about it and then talk about it if you, if it, you know, that's number one. Point number two, Ali Yassin and Ali Abaid, get me some fucking web development leads, please, guys, because our clients on that side pay, 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 pay the most. And I'll be honest and say it's been three fucking months. Maybe it's not been three months. I could be wrong, but just get me some fucking React leads please do do what we need to do kick whatever asses you need to kick tell me what fucking deep but we need to spend a hundred dollars just buying web development get I, I don't fucking care but please get me some web development leads before the end of september which should be realistic okay so just 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 do what you need to do like proper web development leads not someone who wants a 99 dollars fucking wordpress website it's just fucking waste wordpress is just a waste of time like react js would be great so that's just the, the 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 two points and thank you amit and i am being serious do think about it obviously your question me you know critical thinking but deeper if dar global goes would i go no i would find a way to keep you within the team because i think you've got the right attitude and you do something that i think could be valuable here so i like people that have a great attitude and you do have a great attitude given that you're not part of our actual team you know what i mean you are yeah i feel like you are that's why i'm like oh, okay cool. you know make it happen so fine great let's just wrap now with mo mo why do you have your camera off the whole time bro oh, no, i have to switch over to where are you can you hear me yeah where are you i'm at home i'm outside 
listening to you guys. Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> Mo, with all due respect, mate, I thought that you were out with your kid or something. If you're at home, can you not just be on the laptop like everyone else? I don't get that. My camera don't, my camera don't work on my laptop for Zoom. Uh, okay, can you get another camera then? That's an unacceptable answer to me, mate. Like you work remotely. Of course you can fix your camera or buy another camera for Zoom. It's not, I'm not asking something that's unreasonable. When you're at home and we're doing a remote meeting, you can't have your camera off the whole time and think it's cool. It's not cool, bro. I hope you understand that. You're at home. No, that's right. Yeah. No, that's why I'm on my phone. And it's not the camera. It's a Zoom. Zoom the software. Okay. So, so let, me, let, me, let, let me rephrase. Please fix it however you need to fix it. But when we have obviously our meetings, because you're not at the Friday meetings, because obviously you go to the mosque, but you can't be on these meetings. Can you just please fix your desktop Zoom thing? Like sit, fix it. Is that okay? Yeah, no, I had a look at it already. I'll look at it again. But look, please. it works on, on Weber and stuff, but I'll have a look at it again. No problem. Yeah, thank you, mate. Now I appreciate that. So, so separate to that, dude, uh, what, what, what are your key kind of takeaways in terms of things that you think you could change or adjust? Well, look, can I just ask you a question first? Yeah, yeah, I, I yeah, know it might be stupid. No, no. Uh, like the dark global client now, who's the main contact for the client? There seems to be a lot of guys on this call and there's a lot of guys that's involved in the project. But who's the main contact for the client that runs several. the project? Uh, so so probably I would say Temi would be the main contact overall for the project. Because, yeah, okay, so I don't know, it seems like, you know, because of the issue with the client, it seems like, I don't know, this is a, the, 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 the takeaway I get from it. Like, you read through that WhatsApp thing and there was like questions from the client, but nobody responded. So my thought was, like, isn't there like a main person that manages the project that's supposed to respond to the to you know, to, to the so, client's so, so. request questions okay. or whatever. Yeah. Okay. So I don't so. know. Yeah. No, no, so no, no, I think, no. I think that, and this is a big project and it looks like a big project. Why isn't there like a main person that sort of manages everything okay. or is the main communication for the, for the client? Okay. Okay. I think if that was so, like so, so, put so, in so. place because, because I think, yeah. And, and this is the thing like, Look, you have the group chat and the client, you send all okay, the Mo, chats stop, on Stop, the... stop, stop, stop. I'm going to say stop now because I've been trying to come in and, and I, I appreciate... That's not really a takeaway, bro. You, you, for you, what are you going to change? You're, what, you're, what I'm hearing here is a complaint and I accept it. But no, that's... it's not a complaint. It's just... No, no, stop, stop. Answer my question. My, my question is what is your... The, your takeaway is we need a project manager. I agree. We've said it's Temi. That will change. What are you going to change? I'm not asking about what the team should do better, mate. That's the wrong fucking... What are you going to change? That's what I'm asking. It's simple. No. Nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, go ahead. Now, look, for me, it's just trying to understand the process, right? Okay. And like I said, I'm new on right. the project. So I need to understand the process of the project and how the project works. How long have you and been on the project? who's in charge of... I haven't been that long. I think... Time how long have I been here? No, like a couple of... Time like on. maybe four weeks now maybe or three weeks because and the only thing that i was involved on in the project was to review the the console eight so the console you know to review the console otherwise i wasn't and i checked the website speed those are the things that i checked and i made my recommendations regarding those things right okay okay so so um i think as far as yeah involvement on the project that is that is as far as i'm gone um but i think my takeaway is like you know what i think if there's a i'm going to say this again, if there's somebody that that that's leading the project that we all can communicate to mm -hmm. and Tell understand me. and and that person can coordinate all the tasks and stuff and just follow up with the rest of the team, guys. Have the task, and uh, even follow up with the okay. client or communicate okay. with the client. So, okay. I think you know if if that was in place, I think it would probably resolve these issues, or would we want to we want to have these issues that we're having now with the client. So. Okay. Okay. Um, so, understanding of the project. Okay. 
you know who the leader is now. It's Temi. Understood. Is there anything else, mate? I think, yeah, I think the other thing is just communicate with the rest of the team and follow up on, you know, the status of uh, of uh, how far things are with the, with the development and the technical SEO and just making sure that things have been implemented or it's going to be implemented. Okay. And okay. setting timelines for those implementations. Okay. 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 Cool. All right. All right. Fine. Thank you. That works. That works. Good. All right. Thank you. Thank you for that, man. Now that works. Um, all right. Anything else finally from the team that you wanted to ask or discuss? I think I've gone around with everybody now. Yeah, go ahead, Ali. Yeah, there is one thing that I would like to actually talk about. Uh, it's 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 basically regarding what uh, Mo is talking about. And it somewhat makes sense. So the thing is that lots of tasks that SU has to perform is being performed by Amit. Let's suppose if, if either it's... Uh, yeah. the 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 meta title or description yeah. or if it's the posting and so on and so forth so the the the, the thing is we discussed i discussed with Malcolm yesterday that we're going to have meeting so they can do it by themselves so that they are not restricted so as you said all the things that can be done by them by the seo team itself without uh, web development getting involved we need to just figure that out and we need to just give them so that they know that, hey, these, these, these things, we don't need your help with. These are the only things that, that we need your help with. So fix these for us and rest will take care of it. So yes, we, 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 we are. So, so this is in process and it, it will be improved by tomorrow. Yeah. No, that was um, a response for you, mate. Did, you, did that all make sense, dude? Yeah, no, it makes sense. I think, I think from our side it will definitely help us. Uh, okay. Instead of depending on those guys. Okay. okay. Yeah. The, and the, look, uh, Mo, the issue that was during this communication, the, the specific chat was that this is a a main group, but here we are discussing the web development stuff only. And the 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 issue was SEO issue that she tagged us on. That was that. On on SOAPs, the ad, it says dar minus dar space global. That's not part of web development. So Amit came to me and he was looking into it. He's like, Ali, I can't find it. I said, it's not for you to find. It's an SEO task, and you don't need to worry about it. So I went in and and, and uh, basically replied uh, regard, regarding him. So so I agree that there is lots of uh, space in terms of communication that we are we we need to basically fill. So we brought uh, Malcolm in the group now. So he should be able to now, because I think Carla and the guys, the way they are functioning is they want one specific group for all the issues. And that's why we need to make sure all our leaders of of other groups are in, in on, on that group as well, of other departments, sorry. Uh, so now who's there. And anyone else that we need to add, let's add them, that's all. Okay, cool, great, amazing, thank you. Um. Cool, guys. I know that this... So thank you. Thank you, Ali. Thank, thank you, everyone, for your contribution today. I appreciate that I kept you on calls for a long time. Um, but I hope that... I, I genuinely hope it's valuable in that it makes you aware of things that you previously didn't maybe necessarily see, if that makes sense. So who's Priyanka Shukla? It's not my family. She, she just came and she's been ringing on us. Yeah. She, yeah. Came in today. New SEO She's intern, intern. Right? She just started today. Priyanka, are you on the client side or the internal? You have no idea. I've been added to the SEO client side. Okay. okay. Fix your audio, please, because I can barely hear you. But I, 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 I hear... Oh, you got a blue screen. you got a blue light filter, it looks like. Nice. According to your glasses. So, um, please fix your audio if that's okay. But welcome. Do you, do you understand what I said, Priyanka? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What did I say? It's worse, actually. But what was the what what, what Okay, okay. F yeah, fix fi fix your audio. Just fix it. Fix your audio. Yeah, yeah. Try try and speak louder. If that's possible. Uh, every, uh, so, Temi, 
you need to talk to your Shastri about how people are being interviewed because people cannot come in and have these problems. It tells me that the interview process is flawed. Does that make sense? Don't worry, uh, Priyanka, you've done nothing wrong. It's not, it's not, it's not for you, but um, I, I don't understand why this happens. Does that make sense, Temi? Yeah, of course, of course not. Like I interviewed her and her audio was fine in a way by, so I don't know, maybe it's just the, I don't know what she changed. Okay. Your audio is bad yeah. in two for some reason, uh, Priyanka. But what I would recommend then, Temi, is that people need to, that needs to be checked anyway as part of the interview process. Mm -hmm. Let's just jump onto Whereby. Let's just jump onto Zoom. Let's just jump onto Google Meet. Cool. Same audio. No problem. Now let's start the interview. Something like that, as mm -hmm. an example. Whatever. Like, yeah, just, just fix that process. Uh, but, but Priyanka, welcome. I'm sure you do well. Don't worry about what I've just said. It's your first day. Um, okay, fine. Look, thank you, everybody, um, for staying on. I know it's been long, but I think, for me at least, it's been quite insightful and revealing and i hope it's been for you as well in terms of you know what we need to fix no doubt this has applications for every single group that we're in so i am hopeful that there'll be a ah yeah we lead you're right we lead what were your takeaways dude while you're busy texting dude, dude you, you, you yeah go ahead no go ahead go ahead go ahead exactly the problem is what is causing it how we can fix it okay 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 cool thank you so thank you for that walid and that has implications for what we do internally right so ali all of the uh, ali yasin ali abaid and walid what's your last name walid walid farooq 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 uh, write it on f a r o o q f a double r u k h oh Write it on your WhatsApp, write it on your Zoom name so I can see. I'm going to change it on WhatsApp. Just write it on your Zoom name um, if it's okay. So I can, uh, guys, uh, a good habit to get into is to say people's first names, last names, and their role. It's just a good habit and standard to maintain. Um, so, so there you go, Walid, Walid Farouk. So uh, Walid, I think the key, Walid Farouk, Ali Yassin, Ali Abay, the key thing for all of you is this has applications to the internal group. This morning, I left a three and a half minute voice note with all of the things that I am thinking about. Extreme ownership. Don't listen to it and do nothing about it. Assume that, well, I can answer all of those questions or I can find out what the answer is. So, so please do do that. And, and then obviously commit to timelines and don't accept anyone who doesn't give you timelines and who doesn't give you deadlines and 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 all of that. OK, so 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 so, so that's that part there. Right. On that note, thank you, everybody. I know that you've got a lot of work to get on with. I, I appreciate you all. And I'm just looking forward to seeing the success and results. Um, can Priyanka, Walid, Mo, Kaylin, Amit, you guys can all head off. And the rest of you stay. I want to talk about uh, another client and some other stuff briefly. So thank you, you, you guys. Thank you, Amit. Thank you, Walid. Thank you, Priyanka. And thank you, Kaylin.